Hello guys, welcome to the YouTube channel for Mania. So in today's video is all about the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So I have been using the Galaxy Note 10 Plus from the 2019 onwards. So it's been three years I'm using this guy as my daily driver. So after this three years, actually it's got the final update. That's the Android 12 with the one new UI. For that was the final update for the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. As you guys can see, it's already in Android uh, 12 software version. I will show you. So it's in One UI 4 and Android 12. So it comes with Android 9 and finally upgraded to Android 12. So the Galaxy Note 10 Plus journey is now completed. And uh, but still the phone is superb. Actually, I really enjoyed the phone and everything is awesome. But there are few reasons. Actually, the one of the main reason is no more Android updates is coming to this guy. Also, the next reason is I'm using this is an Exynos version. That means the Indian version with a 4G one. So hopefully 5G would come to India and other countries uh, soon in 2022 itself. So I thought of upgrading to a newer uh, 5G phone also. So actually, there are some phones in my list, and in this video itself, I'm show you which phone I'm gonna upgrade. So. uh there are only few options for me and uh, i will give a clue right now so the galaxy fan boys might know by looking at the wallpaper which phone i am going to upgrade so and uh, this yes guys so the samsung galaxy s21 ultra and you guys know that the s 22 Ultra is on the way because just February 9 the launch of the Galaxy S22 Ultra. So you could get the Galaxy S21 Ultra even cheaper. Okay, so I am planning to upgrade to this Galaxy S21 Ultra. Boy. So you can see both are looking excellent. I am said the excellent wallpaper on both. So I really like uh, these two guys. But actually, I will tell uh, the main reasons. So first of all, the main reason is the refund of the. Maybe this is the refresh rate. So this guy got one twenty hertz of refresh rate. So you guys can see. So it feels really smooth. I would show in comparison. So on top. So you could see. So on the right, the Galaxy S twenty one Ultra is way smoother than the Galaxy. But, but I would uh, tell you the Galaxy Note ten Plus is still a word device in twenty twenty two also. Okay, and the next thing is regarding. I would show. I'm just. The major thing which I'm gonna miss is the in-hand feel. Actually, the Galaxy Note 10 Plus is very slim. Actually, it's perfect in 100%. I really like, and you can see the thickness of the Galaxy Note 10 Plus is just 7.9 mm, and of this guy is uh, what we call 8.9 mm. Also, the weight 196 over on the Galaxy Note 10 Plus versus 227. But actually, I know that actually I would be cop up within just a week, and also I just prefer the Galaxy uh, S21 Ultra. Also. We are getting the latest scoring over the last seven victors over here. We are scoring over the last six over here. And the next thing we are gonna miss is this guy. That's the S Pen. Okay, S twenty one Ultra. And the main reason is I am not a fan of this S Pen. Is actually I didn't use S Pen much. Actually, if there are anyone who is uh, using S Pen a lot, then I would suggest only going for the Galaxy Note twenty. That means the upcoming S twenty two Ultra, which is also a mixer of Note plus S for the final, right? And then if you look at this uh, PPA of this both, actually let me play a video on both really quick. So guys, let's look at the displays on both. This is the Galaxy Note 10 Plus on the bottom, and on the top we have the Galaxy S21 Ultra, and almost both are the same resolution. And if you ask me about the PPA, the Galaxy Note 10 Plus have 498 versus this guy have 515 PPA. And if I observe really close, still I'm not able to find. But if you ask me which is slightly better, then I would say approximately one uh, to two percent, and I would say the Galaxy S21 Ultra is a slightly better in terms of contrast. and all and both these displays are HD 10 plus certified display so display I mean segment both are still neck in neck i would say actually i can't say it as a really clear win for the galaxy s21 but still both are neck in neck so in display and audio segment actually i would say the galaxy note 10 plus is still a word device in 2022 okay and i will is is the same uh, case with the audio also so dolby atmos audio is really nice i would really quickly play an audio At first, let's play on the Galaxy Note 10 Plus, and uh, let me turn on the Dolby Atmos. So actually, yes, the Dolby Atmos is turned on. Let's play.
Ooh. So from the Galaxy Note 10 Plus, you can see the audio. Okay, now it's time for the Galaxy S21 Ultra. Okay. Okay. So guys, uh, that's a clear win for the Galaxy S21. I think, I thought that actually that would be a, uh, a tie as the display, but it's a slight win. I would say approximately about three to five percentage a win for extra win for the Galaxy S21 Ultra. Then while it comes to process, actually I'm not a fan of really hardcore games, but I actually I play Call of Duty occasionally and all. And actually in the case of Galaxy Note Plus, after approximately 15, 15 minutes, the phone gets a bit heat. Uh, that means over, overheating and all. I'm actually drops performance and all so actually that's uh, also another area where i thought of an improvement so in this case this has exynos uh, latest press that means exynos 2100 so that's also 5 nanometer versus 7 nanometer over here and globally you are getting over here you can get the snapdragon 855 versus snapdragon triple eight for the other countries and all okay and uh, so and if you compare the ufs storage the galaxy s21 ultra has a 3.0 versus 3.0 that's not a big difference and the next thing is what really matters for most of the people okay so in the camera segment and these are uh, I would say of next level cameras on the Galaxy S21 Ultra because this has the main camera at 108 MB versus 12 MB and the next we have a uh, periscope telephoto over here then a telephoto and a ultra wide camera over here so uh, over here we are getting just a 12 MB telephoto, 12 MB ultra wide and a 12 MB normal one. But the samples, that means the output of the Galaxy Note Plus is still awesome. But I am missing the zoom features, that means 100x zooming over here. So here on the Galaxy S21 Ultra, we are getting, sorry, let me show you. So we are getting the maximum 10x optical, 30x digital and all the way to 100x zooming on the Galaxy. So, uh, uh, S21 Ultra versus just a normal uh, 10x digital zoom on the Galaxy Note Plus. So that's also an area which I really liked about the Galaxy S21 Ultra. And in front camera also there is a huge huge upgrade from the direct 10 MB to the direct 40 MB away. So that's also a huge update over here. And uh, then if you ask me uh, if the few of my cons I faced is actually if my day starts from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. then it's perfectly fine in the case of the battery backup of the Galaxy Note Plus. If it extends from 9 to 8 or 9 to 10 then actually I am facing some battery issues the, uh, and the main reason is at uh, for the past uh, I would say from the first year and second year I was not facing such issues and I would show you the main reason actually as iPhone Samsung also have the battery health okay so that means uh, if your battery is 100% then you are getting the maximum battery backup and as you use gradually the battery health decrease and you can see currently my battery health is it is showing battery health is 94 you can see battery health is 94 and the app which i'm using is adult benchmark here you can see the battery health so that's the reason which i'm felting uh, the battery backup is a bit less but actually the, during the time uh, if uh, i should extend my uh, working hours from uh, extend two hours and all that i would switch to the ultra so in more that it's perfectly fine for me but still uh, i wish actually i could go all day with the battery and that happens over here with the 5000 mh battery versus 4300 mh battery on the galaxy Note M plus that's make a perfect upgrade for me and in case of the charger i am not selling this charger because i have a 25 watt charger over here within the box but the galaxy s21 ultra listen comes with the charger also i am having the akg headset which is a valuable one for this guy so with the uh, c type so i am also keeping this way with uh, the galaxy s21 ultra so if you ask me uh, do i need the upgrade from the galaxy Note plus to the galaxy s21 ultra then i would say it actually uh, it's because of my personal 
uh, preference I'm updating. I'm still liking the Galaxy Note Plus and I'm keeping this side. Actually, I'm using this guy as my personal daily driver and using this guy as a secondary one. Okay, so the main reasons were actually uh, because of the uh, record that means the 108 MB uh, maximum resolution mode, the uh, zooming, and then what we call the 120 hertz of refresh. I never experienced a 120 hertz of refresh rate as my daily. I want to experience as my daily driver, so it feels more fun to me. Okay, and to the few of the other reasons include the processor 5G uh, and uh, the front camera uh, megapixels also actually the, the front camera of the galaxy the rear camera i'm perfectly satisfied till the moment but the rear camera i'm not uh, so for it sorry the front camera i'm not really satisfied with the uh, camera output or not but this guy is more than enough for me so i'm thought, in, thought of uh, taking the galaxy s21 ultra um, as my daily driver and also the main thing also relies with the battery to 4300 versus all day perfect all day if you're a heavy user to 5000 mAh battery so guys uh, that's all for this video so if you are still using galaxy note plus then it's your personal decision whether you uh, update or not i'm still still telling that the main reason one of the other reasons are it's got the fine update no more android update is coming to the galaxy note 10 plus actually the galaxy s21 ultra is yet to get uh, two more android updates so this was the first android 12 one ua4 was the first update and it's gonna get two more updates okay so that's all regarding my update video with my galaxy note 10 plus so that's all guys signing off it's for mania